All right, you guys, let's do a produce haul. Now, all of this is from Walmart, and I used to not uh, like produce from Walmart because I'm pretty sure one time uh, somebody put a baby diaper in the garlic, um, but I think they've improved past that. So, I got some good deals. Okay, first of all, these bunches of asparagus, $1. Manager special, $1. They look great, $1. Five pounds of carrots, three eighty-eight. These cucumbers were seventy-four cents each. Pretty good. Broccoli was one sixty-five a pound. Three fifty-eight for these bell peppers. Roman picked this out, this pepper, um, and it was eighty-eight cents. All this kale, one forty-eight. Eggplant, a dollar eighty-six. I'm so excited about these. It's peeled garlic. Somebody told me about. Um, they suggested the frozen, um, but. I got this one because it was just what I found, um, and I'm really excited because I hate peeling garlic, and it was only like a little under, it was probably like two fifty dollars about a bag, I think it was under that, um, but I think that's good to not have to peel garlic or anything, oh my god, to me, that is absolutely fantastic, I think it's a good price. <laughs> I can't find this on the receipt, so maybe it was zero dollars, but my husband says two ninety eight, so we'll go with that. These are always a little expensive. The tomato cherubs, they were four forty eight, but I just love them dearly. Um I love that you can sprinkle salt and then I close it and shake it and it's just I just love them, so I'm gonna keep buying them. Coleslaw one eighty seven, one eighty seven. <laughs> I think this was like uh one something, uh I don't know, it was one something. Iceberg lettuce, you know how I feel about it. One pound of uh, baby bella mushrooms, three dollars and twenty cents. Not too bad, I think. That's a pretty big package. I don't I don't even know what this is. Um But it's here. Don't know how much it costs because I don't know what the hell it is. Spaghetti squash. Who would have known that it starts out looking like this? Are you kidding me? <laughs> Are you kidding me right now? Did God base my head off this spaghetti squash? Come on. Are you kidding me? What a life. <laughs> All right, you guys, this is Roman's portion of the haul. Um, this is stuff that's either for him or that he picked out himself. Um, he did great on this shopping trip. He was so awesome. Um, you can kind of hear him raving right now. Um, but uh, that's why I'm actually not uh, going to like have him. I'm not even going to ask him to do this video with me um, because he like, you know, he just it was a long trip and he did really well. So I'm just going to do this. OK, first of all, he picked out this pepper himself. He really wanted this pepper. So that's cool. Um, he picked out some Pringles original. He loves Pringles. They were like one of his favorite foods for a long time. Then he stopped eating them for a little bit. So I guess he likes them again. He was dead set on he wanted this Cheetos mac and cheese. Now, will he eat it? I don't know, but he wanted it. So we're going to try it. Now, we found Snapple Apple. We actually got three of them. I don't know where the other one is. Um, he lugged these to the cart. He like, you know, he helped Eli carry them. Like, but it was so funny. This, he was walking like this because they're very heavy. Uh, but he did such a good job. But hold on. <laughs> so, uh, you know how we had to pick out a frozen pepperoni pizza? I swear this relates to the Snapple Apple. So, for his his feeding specialist, like, wanted him to pick out a um, frozen pepperoni pizza of a different brand to try at his feeding appointment and he did not want to pick one out eli would be like let's try this pepperoni one no he did not want to try any of it um but then he settled that if he could get a cheese one he would also get this um which this isn't his preferred brand so i don't even know if he'll eat the cheese one um but the boxes you can see they're so dented and coming apart and that's because when he was lugging the snapple over he would like chuck it in the cart i'm like no but, uh, yeah, that's why they're a little, you know, uh, messed up. <laughs> so, and then also, I obviously got all of his, uh, favorite pizza. This is his favorite pizza. Somebody asked, uh, earlier what brand, what, uh, not what brand, obviously, it's Celeste, but, uh, what, um, kinds of it he likes, and it's original and four cheese. Um, I think he prefers original, I'm not sure, but he will eat four cheese as well. Um, so yeah, I was really happy we found Snapple Apple, and he just had an awesome trip. He did really well. Um, so yeah, thank you, uh, for watching, and I hope you're having a good night. All right, you guys, let's do a Shaw's haul. Um, I'm not gonna do it in, like, categories this time, because, uh, we got home so late. Um, and I probably, <laughs> I won't do prices. Um, but, um, what are you doing? He's, he thinks he's hilarious. He is hilarious. But, um, but so let's just sporadically get it started. I bought these at a spike. 
And you might say, how can you buy something with your own money out of spite? And I'll tell you. Because when I was a kid, I got in so much trouble because I had this babysitter. And she had these and she left them in the back seat. And I just mouthed face, ate the whole freaking bag. And I got in so much trouble. So I saw this and I'm like, I know this, this stuff tastes like ass. But I'm going to buy it just to eat the whole bag. Just because I can now because I'm an adult. And nobody can tell me no. I probably won't even eat it, but it still means a lot. I donated out of spite. Donations out of spite. Then I bought these Zone Perfect Bars. One's in Fudge Graham, one's in Chocolate Peanut Butter. Only because I got cash back, so I figured I'd try them. Then I got these Perfect Bars because um, I got cash back with that too. And I really wanted to get like easy stuff for on the go. Um, I've had these before. They're all right. They're very rich. I like that, but sometimes they're a little dry. Um, this one is the coconut one coconut peanut butter. I don't like that they don't have a lot of variety of flavors. Um, dark chocolate peanut butter. It seems like all peanut butter. Um, coconut peanut butter. Is that the point? Are they all pe Oh, I get it. There's a peanut on everybody. On everybody. On everyone. Alright, this is just regular peanut butter. I like how this one tastes like peanut butter fudge, kinda. Then this is, uh, what is this? My husband uh, got this, a peanut butter cup one. This isn't a perfect bar, obviously. And then this one is a glazed donut one that he bought. <laughs> All right. All right, you guys. So I couldn't, um, oh my God. I couldn't get the uh, clear American ones. Um, Cause you know, it wasn't Walmart, it was Shaw's. Uh, so I got this uh, strawberry watermelon uh, sparkling water. I hope it's good. Two of those. And then I got um mango pineapple which i don't really like mango at all but usually if it's paired with like pineapple or peach i think it tastes good so hopefully this will be good too all right then my husband got these uh blueberry kodiak pancakes i like the ones or waffles my bad um i think they're the waffles yes waffles um i like the uh pancakes that will come in a cup i used to eat those um so yeah i'm excited to try these tomorrow and then he got a bunch of these uh just cracking egg things this one is Denver, applewood smoked ham, mild cheddar, potatoes, green peppers and onions, and this one is all American, potato, sharp cheddar cheese, and bacon. I'm running out of time. I actually got two of those, two of these. I don't know how to pronounce it, but it's the royal rice, and it's that kind. Um, I think it tastes really good. I love these. They're very convenient. All right, um, I'm still not done. Um, I'll post on my other pages, so see ya. <laughs> Hey, you guys, and welcome to the Shaw's Hall. Um, like I said before, um, I'm not going to do it in categories this time or do prices because we got home really late, so it's going to be kind of scattered, but here we go. My husband got these Atkins uh, coconut chocolate bars. Um, I can't buy these for myself because if I do it defeats the purpose, I will eat the entire container, so... But that's just me. Um, I got this, um, I'm going to say it wrong. Oh, I can just say chickpea curry. I'm excited to try that, maybe over some rice. And also some mushroom masala. I don't know if I'm saying that right, but that looks very good. Um, I got more of those royal rices. Um, oh, it's just this one, the white jasmine. I'm going to use this in the Greek rice that I'm going to cook tonight. Um, we voted on what I should cook in my live. Um, so tonight I'm doing Greek rice. Tomorrow it'll be the pomegranate chicken. And the next day it'll be the ratatouille one. <laughs> um, so then my husband got these uh, dry roasted edamame snacks i guess sea salt snacks um i've never had dry edamame i no you guys told me it's not edamame it's edamame edamame i don't know anyways uh he got these i like the ones that you get in like the produce section all right roman's uh macaroni and cheese then we got i don't even know what these are roasted salted sunflower seeds i like sunflower seeds uh, my husband picked those out. And then roasted unsalted sunflower seeds. Ooh, pardon me. Um, and then I got some watermelon. My husband hates watermelon. I love watermelon, so. Some more shredded iceberg lettuce. And yes, we really do go through it that much that quickly. Pomegranate juice, because I need it for the chicken I'm going to make. Um, let's see, I got two uh, zucchinis, because one of the recipes calls for it that I'm going to make for dinner. Another bag of shredded lettuce. I guess this is pop corners sea salt. My husband picked out these. And then he also picked out some cashews. I got a why did you get why'd you get this huge this thing of cashews when I got a huge gigantic thing of cashews? I was trying to find unsalted and These are salted! I know, it was too late. Oh my god. And some baby bell mushrooms. We're gonna need way more than this. Cause you wanted There's some still two and a quarter. Okay, alright, alright. Alright. 
And just to go off of what I was saying, I got this huge thing of cashews. So was this necessary? <laughs> yes, it was. <laughs> no, it wasn't. That teeny weeny one's gonna be split up. Okay. Also, I needed a vegetable broth for a recipe as well. Then we got two Cabot Vermont cheddar cheeses. I got some Chobani flip yogurts. I I like the, well, I like a lot of them, but I like the pretzel ones the best. My husband got these Mayan farm traditional recipe high fiber whole wheat tortillas. And listen, I'm running out of time, so go follow my other pages. I'll list them in the captions to continue this haul with me. And I hope you're having a good night. All right, you guys, welcome back to the Shaw's haul. So, and I'm not doing this in categories, like I said, or doing prices because we got home very late. So, oh my God, good thing this is like wrapped inside because it came undone. So I got a feta chunk. I'm more of a chunk, okay? <laughs> My husband, um, he got the feta crumbles. Um, then I got this Country Archer Provisions 100% Natural Turkey Jerky Hickory Smoked. Now, this one I think I got in the vegan... Not the vegan. <laughs> Actually, I did. I did. I got it in the... Chaz has like a big vegan section. That's where I found this, but I think it was more supposed to be like organic or something i don't know but i'm telling you it was right next to all the vegan stuff i'm telling you all right now i got some chopped walnuts because i need some for a recipe that i'm doing oh what's this and then um some oregano leaves i do not like oregano but one of the recipes calls for it and I, most of the recipes i've been doing lately have been like calling for oregano so i figure i should just bite the bullet and get it you can't really taste it in a lot of recipes um but oh i don't like the taste of it if you can really if it's really potent then we got some eggs, and a lot of people are like, why do you buy eggs when you have chickens that lay them? Um, well, because, first of all, um, not everybody does, but we wash our eggs, um, you know, when they come from the chickens, and that takes a lot of work. Um, also, I love donating them, um, but also, we don't get enough. It's only, like, the beginning of spring, so we're getting maybe seven a day. Usually, it's a dozen, which then we often don't have to buy eggs. I can use those ones and donate, but for now, we supplement and buy them. Roman's Pringles. I had to buy more because I ate all of them. Um, then we have Newman's Own Sesame Ginger. My husband picked that out. Wow, I like that color pink and purple. That's very pretty. Um, some M&M Minis for Roman. He wanted M&Ms the other day. Um, riced cauliflower. Asian inspired rice cauliflower with mixed vegetables. He's laughing. Um, in a seasoned soy sesame sauce. He was, he's going to do something with this for like a lunch or something. And then um, more of the rice I like. The Royal Ready Rices. I can't pronounce it, but it's this kind. And then I got capers because I really want my husband to try capers now that he's eating a lot of salads. I love capers and salads, so I think it's a good addition. <laughs> then we got some ground turkey, of course. Um, as you know, we eat a lot of that. Um, then the crumble feta I was talking about um, for my husband, another one. I got Parmesan cheese for a recipe, and I love how it comes in this little bag. I've never bought uh, Parmesan cheese in a bag before. That's just my son's stimming. Um, I've never bought it like this before. I thought it was so cute. <laughs> then I got some tomatoes. I need two for a recipe. I'll eat the other two. I love raw tomatoes with salt. Um, I got a bag of onions because I just didn't want to have to go put a big one in an individual bag. Um, okay, so to continue this haul with me, go follow my other pages. I will put them in the caption. Um, so yeah, hope to see you there. All right, you guys, welcome back to the Shaw's Hall. Okay, so let's see. Some sour cream, Daisy sour cream. I got cash back, so of course I had to get that brand. Um, some peanut butter. Skippy. And um, I got these Mission Sweet Hawaiian Flour Tortillas. Listen, I got the street tacos last time, and I know everybody's ragging on me to cook them before I eat them, but I like them uncooked, so these I bet will be good uncooked too. Okay, then Roman's Pop Tarts, of course, and then melatonin. We, he uses melatonin to go to bed, I know. It's terrible, oh my god, rah, 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 horrible parenting. Rah. Okay. All right, you guys, I'm so excited because we're going to be trying this wow. Nick's ice cream. That's because uh, my son doesn't like the sound of the dog barking, but she can't come out now because there's food everywhere and it's got to wait. He has headphones if he doesn't want to use them can't do anything about it and uh it's not something i respond to if he gets the accommodation and doesn't take heed of it oh well um so this is nick's swedish uh chalk chalk lod. i don't know it looks good i wanted this one it's cherry uh cherry chalka flaco uh, did i say that wrong probably um but they look really good um i got more of the pretzel chobani flips i love these i eat them like every day my husband got these protein yogurts this one is strawberry it's the okios one or ratio protein my bad hmm. 
And then this one is vanilla. And then this one is vanilla as well. Hi, Roman. Oh, he has his Captain America shield. <gasps> no. She's not going to go to daycare. Why don't you put your headphones on? You have a cool shield. It's on the mini toy box. You got it from your toy box. You got it from Eli's toy box? I think that was from your toy box. Some more of these just egg things. This one is Southwest style, chorizo, Monterey Jack cheese, potatoes, tomatoes, green and red bell peppers, jalapeno peppers, and onions. And this one is protein packed, which is sharp cheddar cheese, pork sausage, and bacon. That'll be my husband's. I don't like sausage. Um, this is more of the white jasmine for the Greek rice tonight. Then some peppers for the Greek rice tonight. And my husband also wants some for omelets. Some tomato puree, which surprisingly was very hard to find. Um, some cocktail stirrers. It's those baby corns, I think. I never got into those. My husband loves them. Um, this, uh, this is, I might say it wrong, Kalamata olives. I need them for a recipe. Then my husband got some uh, cream of rice. I've never had that before. Some chocolate caramel fudge, uh, you know, the Atkins ones I showed earlier. Then I got these chocolate chip cookie dough quest things just to have on the run. And then, ah, more jerky, turkey, jerky, rah! All right, you guys, let's do another Shaw's haul. So, here we go. Um, I only know some of what's in here, somewhat. Um, so, let's look. I do see Kodiak, uh, waffles, which I'm excited about. I heard you got chocolate chip. Is that what this is? Yes, chocolate chip. We've been having the blueberry ones. They're very good, very fluffy, and they're wonderful. I love them. Oh, and you got the blueberry, too. I'm glad. I was hoping you got some of these, too. Alright, let's see. Oh, and so I've been really loving these. Um, you can only, I'm assuming this is everywhere, but only at Walmart I can get those, um, what are they, all clear American or something sodas. Um, but uh, I found this one at Shaw's, the signature strawberry watermelon flavored sparkling water beverage. But I also tried the mango pineapple, and I usually don't like mango, but it was really good. Um, they didn't have mango, um, so he got me four of these, which is so nice of him. All right, I'm excited about that. Doo -doo -doo. All right. And then some strawberries. We needed some berries. And then a bunch of cat food. Um, the grilled kind, because my cats don't like the pate one. Um, so we got ocean white fish and tuna. Beef feast and gravy. All right. What else? Tuna feast again. Listen, that's mostly what they like. And here we go. Here's another one. Yeah, same thing. But that's what they like. Okay. So, on to other things. He got my pretzel yogurt. I love this yogurt. I've been eating it, like, every single day. I love this yogurt. Um, and then, oh my god, you guys. Have you guys had this Nick's ice cream? My husband follows this, uh, personal trainer. And I don't know his name. My husband watches him all the time. And he is great. And I'm gonna, I'm gonna ask my husband what his name is and, uh, tag him or at him in the comments. Um, because he's such a cool guy. Like, he's so down to earth and he's not judgmental. He's how a personal trainer should be. Or, uh, maybe he's not a personal trainer. Like, a nutrition person. I don't know. But he's so, like, kind and he's very uplifting. And that's how, that's how you get, um, you know, that's how you reach people. You know what I mean? Not by being a jackass. So, he showed these in one of his videos and my husband bought them they are so good and they're so filling i ate because a whole one of these is 290 calories so i fucking mad face on this whole thing right i was so full i couldn't even eat dinner like six hours later i was so full like just from this okay but um anyways they're really good so then he um has this yogurt the okios i don't think this is what he normally gets but i don't think they had his he buys like a protein one usually um and then i got my mom's cereal so yeah, I hope you all are having a good day, and I'll see you later. All right, you guys, let's do a Hannaford haul. <laughs> all right, so I got smart food for myself because I've been craving it, and then when I decided, like, okay, I'm not going to go out and get it, I'm just going to go the night without it, um, a Facebook ad came on for it, so then I had to have it, and I know they probably did that purposely, but they won, so I got it. The best part of smart food is when you get to the bottom of the bag and all the little pieces. Oh my god, it's so good. I can't explain it, but it's so good. Then we got some uh, Lay's potato chips for my mom and my son. They love these. Then I got some of these uh, Vlasic Snackums Kosher Dill Mini Pickles. Um, oh my, can you not? Jeez. 
I got these pickles because, uh, you know, Clawson is really my go-to. They're my favorite, but lately I got two batches of them that just didn't taste good. Um, so I'm trying these because I remember being a kid and eating them, and they were pretty, pretty good. So I got these ones. All right, then I got this Cape Cod Cranberry uh, Diet Ginger Ale. Um, I honestly got it because it was like a dollar and 45 cents, which for Hannaford's is very good. I think it tastes really good for diet. I mean, it's not my favorite, but for a dollar 45, yeah. It's pretty good. This is a side note. Um, I bought this like a couple days ago. My husband had some today, but I've never had it before. It's zero sugar cherry 7-Up. Um, I'm going to try some at the end of this video because I've never had any before, and I really want to know what it tastes like. So I'll compare it to the Diet Cranberry uh, Ginger Ale by Cape Cod. So we'll see. Then we got some popsicles. Those are for my mom and my son again. Then we got some heavy cream because we're going to do this experiment tonight where you do like cheese, like American slices of cheese with ramen noodles and heavy cream. We're going to see if that works. We're going to do it on live. And to go with that experiment, I couldn't find regular ramen noodles anywhere in the store. Neither, neither could Eli, so it wasn't just me. Um, so these are, I'm going to say it wrong. I'm going to try. I'm going to try. Sapporo Ichiban 5-Pack Tonkatsu Ramen. It looks good. It was only $5.29 for, like, how many? Five? And yeah, it's still kind of expensive for ramen, but still. All right, you guys, now I'm going to try uh, this stuff, see how it is. I forget how my husband said it was. I think he said, basically, it was okay, but it wasn't his favorite, so we'll see. I don't want to sneeze. I think it's good. Compared to the cranberry one, that one's better. But this is okay. This is okay. <laughs> All right, you guys, I am so excited to share this haul with you because I got it all for $32.49. $32.49. It's a Walmart haul. But look at that. $32.49. Are you making a guest appearance? Okay. All right, I got these queso ruffles chips, which I'm excited about because I love their... Uh, uh, cheddar and sour cream ones, I think. And so I am excited about these queso ones. Then we got two Aromans pizzas, which went up in price. They're usually 99 cents. These, this time it was like one something. Um, some roasted chicken flavor ramen. We got some training treats for Rosie. My pants keep falling down and I was in the store like, oh my God. Cause we get recognized a lot in Walmart specifically. I'm like, oh my God, people are gonna see me. I'm gonna be hiking up my pants the whole time. Okay. Now um, I got one, two, three of these Chobani flips. Of course the pretzel kind, I love it. But then I'm also gonna try this peanut butter dream. I'm not a huge peanut butter person, but it had these like little chunks of crunchy things that look nice. And then my husband bought these Okios, I think it's called. Um, triple zero in cherry, I'm guessing. Yeah, cherry. <laughs> Two things of, uh, Snapple Apple, of course. And, uh, my son is listening to, like, rave music in the background. So, that's what that is. It's even louder. <laughs> oh. Um, some Pop-Tarts, Roman's favorite flavor, cookies and cream. I'm so excited I was able to get these again. So it's the uh, Clear American Sodas. I think these taste so good. Um, I just love them. This is the watermelon. I know this one is good. I've never tried the wild cherry, so I'm excited to try that. All right, then we got some bow tie pasta because at feeding therapy next time, they want to try different like shapes. They mentioned penne, but they didn't, I don't know if I'm saying that right, but they didn't have it. So we got bow tie. Um, and then Roman got two of these unicorn shapes, Kraft Mac and cheeses. They were only a dollar each. He picked the unicorn over uh, frozen characters, which I was surprised. All right, and now we have one, two chicken flavor ramens, one, two creamy chicken flavor ramen. So that's four so far. Um, then we have two pork flavored ramens, um, a picante chicken flavor ramen, hot spicy chicken cup of noodles, beef flavor, another beef flavor. And listen, I know ramen isn't impressive because it's so cheap anyways, but look how much this is for $32.49. Look at all of that, $32.49. I mean, that is a good deal. All right, you guys, I'm here with Roman, and we're going to do a haul video of all the toys he got from Walmart um, from my mother and father-in-law. Are you excited? Okay. All right. What's this? Who's that? Mario. Mario. 
Do you want to pick one out? Mm -hmm. Oh my gosh, who's that? Sonic the Hedgehog. Yeah, but who is it? What character? Is. Hmm. Let's read it. Let's read it. Let's see. Um, I believe so, yes. I know nothing about Sonic the Hedgehog. Hold on. Eli, who is this? No, this. Nobody in the house knows who this is. Can you guys tell us? <laughs> Is that a Sonic figure? Yeah. It's... That might be from the... There's a new Sonic movie coming out. <gasps> and who's this? Sonic. That's Sonic. Whoops. All right, ready? <gasps> who's that? Eggman. Egg, is it really? I think so. Is that really the name? It is. I Dr. Eggman. Yep. <laughs> He's a villain. And who's that? Wow! And who's this? Fire Mario! Really? Yeah, he's right. Fire oh my god, that's so cool. And there's, is there one more? One more. Who's that? Luigi! Luigi! Oh my god. You got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven new plushie toys. Is that what they're called? Plushes? Uh -huh. Oh, okay, he's gonna bring him to his room one by one. We will see you later. <laughs> all right, you guys, let's do a Walmart haul. All oh. right, first of all, I got this big ass bone for my big ass dog, and I know, I know you got a problem with it because you guys got a problem with everything, but I'm gonna go give it to her. She's excited. <laughs> all right, then I got some smart food. I've been on a smart food kick. Some fresh pet. Yes, I know there was a recall. I've been paying attention. All right, now. Some Pioneer Woman glasses. I'm so excited because I'm going to use them for my iced coffee. Um, so I'm going to like fill them tonight. Put them in the fridge. And um, listen. If you know me, I have these. Can you see? Let me show you. Just hold on, hold on. I have these beautiful Pioneer Woman trash cans that I got for $13 each. I got three of them. And the Pioneer Woman herself actually commented on my video that, that like made my month all right then we got some snapple apple of course and this baby shark easter egg thing that roman picked out all right so in here a unicorn egg roman picked out uh clear american peach soda Oh, some uh, white Pringles. Roman was like, I need the white ones because they're the pizza flavor. So, uh, yeah. He has me buy pizza flavor a lot. I don't ever remember him actually eating them. So, we'll see if he eats them. All right. Today, when we went out to eat, he ate all his meal. I was shocked. All right. It was chicken fingers and fries. But still, sometimes he won't even eat that um, if it's out somewhere. So, foo how do you pronounce this? Fuji apple? I'm excited to try that. Oh, my God. These are Dove Milk Chocolate Waffle Cone Candies. Look at that picture. That, and they were really cheap, too. I was surprised. Spray Catnip. I can't wait to uh, give my cat some of this, especially my uh, my new cat. Kitchen Shears, because I do have some, but they look like our other scissors. Um, so I keep mistaking which ones are the Kitchen Shears, and these are like a dollar. Key Lime Flavored M&Ms. I'll try them on camera. Some uh, caramel eggs from Cadbury. Some training treats salmon for Rosie. She loves those ones. We don't really use them for training, to be honest. Um, and then this one is white grape clear American soda. And then we got our dog food. And I know you got something to say about that too, but that's what we're feeding her. And then we got this. That's my husband uh, blowing his nose. Uh, Okay, <laughs> and now I, we got this uh, dog food for Rosie, and I know you. I made a promise to myself about um, maybe two weeks ago that I wasn't going to get Dunkin' Donuts coffee, and I was going to make coffee at home, um, and uh, so 13 out of 14 of those days, I still got Dunkin' Donuts coffee, <laughs> so instead of using the Keurig, I'm going to try doing this type of iced coffee again, which isn't too bad, but I mean, I like it. I like the Starbucks one. My husband got this Reese's one. 
Do, do. Which I use the Keurig as well. It's just Yeah, he uses the Keurig a lot. Me, I am literally such an impatient and impulsive person that like making a cup of coffee in a Keurig for me seems like too much. I don't like it. Like that is too much time for me. <sighs> I need to work on it. I need to work on it. These are for Rosie. I'm going to give her some now. Okay. Yep, I see you. I'm going to give you some. I'm push it for it. Do I have to? You never have to. <laughs> she already did. <laughs> He's like, make her sit for it, but she already sat. Good what are these? <laughs> you didn't read it in the store, did you? What do you mean? You're disgusting. You're disgusting. It's sweet potato with duck in it. It's sweet potato with duck. You're just. Do you you're see how happy she looks? Look at the mouth. The mouth Rosie, is how can you how can you see the love I have for the ducks outside and then eat them? I um, eat chicken, but don't talk about it. Because she's your one and only. That's how she feels. <sighs> <laughs> Look at that pretty sit. She really wants that duck. Oh no. <laughs> All right, so we did just that, or my husband did, to be honest. Um, he got him this 80, um, you know, 80s DVD CD holder thing. Hold on. This is what it looks like. Oh, my God, get off. Hold on a second. <laughs> okay. Doo-doo. All right, so... And it's because my son um, just got this uh, DVD player for the car. I'm super excited to see how it works instead of, like, a phone. All right, so let's put these in. So first we got, what is this, the Lego Movie? The Lego Movie and the Lego Movie, the second part. So let's put that in. Doo -doo 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 -doo. Ha -ha. Wonder Park, this is one of his favorite <laughs> movies. Put that in. Doo -doo. Oops. Oh yeah. Oh my god, you had to move him too. <laughs> and then we got Cars 2, which Cars 1 is one of his favorite movies. Oh my god, does this have... Oh, it comes with a Blu-ray. Alright, I'll put that in there too. Why not? You know what I mean? Spongebob Season 12. This one's been through the ringer. Oh wow, there's tons of them in here. Now we have Paw Patrol, um, Brave Heroes, Big Rescues. Oh, it looks just like the uh, SpongeBob one. The Secret Life of Pets. This is actually my Duck Howard's favorite movie. Despicable Me, he loves minions. Now we have Toy Story, and like I said, um, I'm surprised he got this because he used to be scared of this. Oh, this is a pretty one, or a nice looking one. Spongebob, the complete movie collection, I think. Yeah. This one comes with two. The Little Mermaid, this is another one he picked out, I think, two days ago. The Lego Batman movie, another one he just picked out. Oh, it's a two one, and look at their black, all black, that's so cool. And last but not least, Elmo's World, he picked this out, like, a couple days ago, too. A nice, bright disc, I appreciate it. All right, let's count how many we have. So, two, four, six, oops, I missed one, eight, ten, twelve, fourteen, fifteen out of eighty filled. So, they should go good with his new DVD player. I'm excited, and I will let you all know once we try it how it goes. You guys, we just went to Tractor Supply, and look what Roman got. Hold on. <laughs> New chicken boots. He has some that he loves from my friend Heather. They were actually supposed to be mine and he stole them. Um, but they're getting a little small. And I found these. And then my husband found them. And we were both like, we need to get him new chicken boots. So these ones are blue. The ones he has now are like maroon. Are you excited, Rome? Okay. For the chicken boots? Okay. He wants to get back to his sto Toy Story. He was watching Toy Story on the DVD player, so that's why he's like, okay. He just wants to, he like wants me to shut up and get this over with so he can get back to his movie. But I wanted to show you guys. So exciting. <laughs>